This is when the lights dim and go out. <laughs> Don't laugh, it's happened before in this room. Ladies and gentlemen, we are live. Welcome to Dew Point, everybody who's here. Thank you for coming. We've got 100 people in the audience this evening. I actually only see about four seats that are missing, which is great. As I said, we're very optimistic. We normally know 30% won't arrive. Looks like we've got 95% attendance this evening, so thank you very much for joining us. And thank you all the guys that are tuning in live tonight to watch us. We're very excited about this evening. It's a special event, a special showcase of Dew Point and what we're doing here. For those of you who don't know, we've only been around now for about a month. Um, as a division of a company that's been around for a lot longer, but we're going to tell you about that in a minute. Um, what I want to start with this evening is to tell you exactly who Dewpoint is. They are a division of Constantia Insurance Company. Wait, oh, Brendan, what wait. What is this? <laughs> it's Throwdown Thursday tonight. So this is a little change of sequence. Brendan has spent far too long telling everyone about Dewpoint. For the first time, we're going to, I'm going to challenge him on every point that he throws your way. And if he can convince me, perhaps he can convince you guys. So it's Brendan Benfield versus the Axe <laughs> for Throwdown Thursday. Let's begin. It's all right, the accountant versus the designer. It's all right, my surname right. translates into the guns. I don't bring a knife to a gunfight. All right, Rob, thank you very much. And I hope that you are able to enjoy it. As I was saying this evening, Dewpoint is a division of Constantia Insurance Never heard of company. Constantia. Never yes, heard of Constantia. Yes. All right. Well, you might not have heard of Constantia, but Constantia has been around since 1952. They're an insurance company that's been part of the South African financial services industry for more than six decades now. They have a long and illustrious history in South Africa. And if you want to do any research on Constantia, please go and do it. They're a registered financial services provider as well as a fully licensed insurance company. There's their FSP number three, quadruple one. Go and look up about us. Get your sense of comfort about who you're dealing with here today. While the division due point might have only been around for a few minutes, Constantia has been around for nearly six decades. And these hallowed halls are the halls you're sitting in of Constantia's this evening. Folks, here's the team of the Dewpoint division. We've all been put together because of our qualifications, our experience, and our personalities. Yes, uh, I am the most beautiful one of the group. Um, and uh, I head up the team here. You will find us in the passages. You'll get to know us the more time you spend with us here. Um, as I said, we've got diff different sets of skills and experience. I come from the financial services industry. I've been in the space for nearly two decades now. I'm a co-founder and shareholder of an insurance company called Prime Meridian Direct. Um, just down the road from here. And I've been doing this a long time. Um, a little bit uh, next to me here is Tim. You can see these are the three chartered accountants over here. We have a particularly appealing look about us, as you can see. And Tim over here, he's been in the banking industry for over a decade now, working in some, uh, working with the first RAND group and all of that. Also, chartered accountant brings with us a lot of stability. And then we've got Stacy over here. Stacy is um, fresh out of Deloitte, but she's been working out of Luxembourg. So she's bringing some international experience to the team with regard to the finances. We've got Jane. Jane has got... 15 years of experience in direct selling, um, and that's your mark. That's, that's your fault. Um, the scratching, you blame him. Um, and uh, Jane is a fantastic member of the team. You will see her. She is um, the lady that you will always see at the front. She's very exciting. And then, of course, we've got Rob. He's the shortest here. Rob um, is our design guy. Everything that you see around you, everything that you touch, whether it's here or online, has been designed by okay. Rob. Okay, that was a very boring description oh, of what. Oh, give me the clicker of some very colorful characters that we actually have working at Dewpoint. So let me tell you the truth. Let me tell you who everyone really is. Oh boy. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Mr. Busy. That. Mr. Busy has got his schedule decked out from 5 o'clock in the morning till, I don't know, past midnight, wakes up in the middle of the night coming up with ideas. Is a closet gamer. So you know, that, you know that game, Clash of Clans, that your kids play? Yeah. Master level. <laughs> All right, keep it above the belt, Rob. Mr. Fussy. That's Tim. Tim over there, right? He is actually the brakes in the business. 
we are a financial services provider, you need to have breaks in a business like ours because we have a lot of regulation that we need to comply with and to make sure that that happens. Also, Clash of Clans level expert. <laughs> Stacy, little Miss Brainy. <laughs> Stacy's at the back there. Always underselling herself. Always the overachiever. But fortunately, we have her in our team. She makes sure that all the finances are running smoothly. Little Miss Friendly. <laughs> That's Jane. She's the smile of Dewpoint, right? You'll all get to know her if you haven't already gotten to know her. And then me. This is fairly lifelike, isn't it? I never knew I was so tall. Mr. Fun. I obviously designed the slides. I'm Mr. Fun. I come from a background, as Brendan said, of design, advertising. I ran a digital agency for 15 years. So I bring the color to the presentation. But I'll give the clicker back to Brendan so we can carry on with the yeah, monochromatic I, I design. It'll only be 60 minutes. If we leave him back, we'll be here all night long. Those are such better colors. It's more relaxing on my brain. Um, all right, folks, why are you all here this evening? Well, um, either we, Rob and I, and our, and our team, or your, uh, or your friends have brought you here this evening because you are in the same set of circumstances that the rest of us are in right now. It doesn't take a genius to look at what's happening in the newspapers, see what's happening on TV and know that South Africa is in a very interesting position. One it hasn't been in for many, many decades. And not only South Africa, but the world. I can't remember in my short life when the world was in such a precarious position. I feel constantly like I'm in a state of chaos. I have no security over where I should live, um, whether my kids and my wife are safe in the streets, where my economic power will be in a few years' time. Will I still be earning? Will I still be here? What is happening politically? I mean, this is one of the only countries in the world that every morning there's something to write politically about in this country. It is a frightening, frightening reality. And it's not just unique to South Africa. The world right now is in big trouble. And so it is that I myself feel like I need something to change. I can't carry on with my particular accounting personality in a state of chaos going forward. But you know what the, the thing is? Um, the thing is that when I started, when I was younger, I didn't think like that. I didn't feel like that. I was invincible when I was younger. When I was younger, I had aspirations like all of you. I had the car poster on my wall. I had the house poster on my wall. I had the wife poster on my wall. <laughs> I, had the, I had aspirations for what my future would look like, as you all did. But time in this place, time in reality, has an interesting effect on all of us. It starts to fade our dreams. We start to settle. We do. And it doesn't matter who you are this, here this evening. It doesn't matter what title or what job you've had. You have settled on one of your dreams. You have said, that dream that I had, I won't get it. And it's okay. Why? Why do we do that? Why do we do that to ourselves? When we're young, we set ourselves on paths of qualification that we believe will get us to the dreams we once had. Now, again, I say, it doesn't matter what your title is, it doesn't matter what your background was. All of us had a dream, and all of us said, we'll walk this path to get to that dream. Some of us spend many, many years getting qualified. Doctors, engineers, accountants, lawyers, we spend many years, and sometimes a lot of money, getting qualified, believing it will get us to our dreams. Then what we do is we get into the economy. That first job that you got, normally if you're quite well qualified, it's pretty good. You're single, you're alone, you're earning quite a bit of money, and it gets you a bank account. And the bank account gets you a credit card and your first car loan. Straight out the gates, you're in debt. Straight out the gates, you're in debt. But sometimes you've got a little bit of money left because you're doing quite well. You're still by yourself. You're single. You're making ends meet. But as time passes, an interesting thing happens to all of us. That money that we were earning, that was just a little bit more than we needed each month, starts getting stretched out in directions we never expected. You know, when you're at home with your parents, there's no such thing as emergencies. Emergencies are the things your parents have to deal with, not you. When you're out the house, emergencies are things you have to deal with. My wife was hijacked on the 19th of January this year. She was one of 70 ladies in Bryanston alone this in, the, in the two months of February and March that were hijacked. That hijacking cost us one and a half million rand. Now, how can it cost one and a half million rand? Her car was only worth 200,000 rand. But you know, I bought her car nine years ago. If I want to replace her car now, it's a million rand. What happened in the last nine years? What happened? The jewelry on her finger. When I bought her a ring when we got married 13 years ago, it cost me 30,000 rand. Now the jeweler says, oh, I can get you that ring, but it's 200,000 rand. What has happened in the last nine years? Those emergencies kill your income 
very quickly, very suddenly. Education. Sometimes as part of your job, you need to continue your education. That means the expenses around your education don't disappear. If you've got educational loans, you're still paying those off. It's drawing down on your cash. And then, of course, this thing called retirement. It's a thing we don't want to think about. It's a thing we cover in our minds. We numb it and put it away. Starts rushing up on us at an incredible pace. How is it when you're 30, you realize you don't have enough time to get on top of your debt to have a retirement that will be decent in the end? And so what happens is your dreams and your aspirations start to fade. Rob, have you ever yeah. experienced this as a designer? I think we're on a slide where we agree with one another. So um, as I said, I ran a digital agency for 15 years. I started my business at a fairly young age. I think I was about 23 years old. Weren't a lot of my friends who had started businesses at that age. And, you know, I don't know whether it's an age thing, but, you know, I'm nearly 40 now, and you start to have more of these feelings of dread about your mortality and things like that. Um, but having started a business, also, I had all those dreams, I had those aspirations. I think when you're young, you're blessed with those type of things. Um, but, at the end of 15 years, I had to exit my business. I wasn't forced to. It was a decision that I made purely because I started to actually realize that it wasn't building proper equity for me. Um, and, you know, you go through, it's just time, I guess. You go through time 15 years later and you think, jeepers, I am now in my late 30s, been doing this. It hasn't done what I expected it to be. You've got the rest of all the pressure on your shoulders. Time to make a decision. Yeah, and you know, so much more true for those of us who are employed. When you lose your job or when you exit your job, whatever it is, you can be the CEO of Anglo. If you walk out your job, have you got anything that you take with you? Have you got it? The years you've spent, have you got anything to show? And so what we discover, ladies and gentlemen, and it comes as a shock to some because, again, we try not to think about these things, is we discovered that that uh, moment when we got our first loan and our first credit card is not a moment. It is, in fact, a journey. It is a journey every single one of us are on just to varying degrees. When you start in life, you're young, you get your first car loan. That's your first debt instrument. You meet somebody, get married, you need a house and a second car. You've now got three debt instruments against your name. You've only just started. You have children, they have medical expenses, they have education they required, and all of a sudden the personal debt starts mounting up. They get bigger, you need a bigger house. They need cars, ultimately, and you can enter your retirement here with five or six debt instruments against your name. Five or six. Rob, where are you on the scale at the moment? <laughs> well, I've got the wife. <laughs> Tick. I've got the bigger house. We're looking at the bigger car. Right, my wife's You're here. buying all of this cash, of course. She hey, isn't well. arguing. So I'm, I'm not quite at the top of that little peak there. I'm going up. I'm about to start the hill. I'm about to start the hill. You're about so, to start the hill. There's the finish line over there, though, Rob. I know, and I came across a very scary statistic yesterday. The Financial Services Board came out with statistics last year that said 94% of South Africans that retire are still financially dependent. And that's dependent on their children, on family members, on friends. It's a frightening statistic. Only 6% of South Africans are going to be financially independent. I don't want to be part of that statistic when I hit 60. And that's absolutely right, Rob. This was the position that we found ourselves in at Dewpoint. point. This is the problem we all have. All of us in this room have this problem right now. All of us in South Africa have this problem right now. I'm and a creative guy. Yeah. I'm a creative guy. Sure. Give us the solutions, Rob. I'm the ideas Colin guy. Wait. I've got a couple of solutions to the problem. I've had 15, 20 years to think about many solutions. One, I could start a business on the side, right? True entrepreneurial spirit. I'm a fairly skilled photographer already. I haven't been wasting my time over the last 20 years. I could start a photography business on the side, maybe work odd weekends, odd evenings. Absolutely. How's that for an idea? No, that's great. Um, you pulled it out from your sleeve there, right? <laughs> See, um, for many of us, that is something that we discuss. We discuss it with ourselves and we discuss it with our spouses. We've got to do something to increase our income into our house. So why don't you start a small business on the side? Why don't I work after hours and on weekends to start my own business? Well, Rob, you know, starting a new business. Okay, fine. It doesn't sound like the cash. best idea. It doesn't sound like the best idea. Photographic equipment is very expensive, especially yeah. with the dollar eight. 
Have How's ideas? your after hours doing at the moment? Do you like oh, worry, I've got more night? ideas. I've got more ideas. I can be the best employee in the business. I can work hard. I can make sure that I get the promotion and I get the raise and I get the bonus. Absolutely. Absolutely. And that's guaranteed, of course, isn't it? Because we know in our employment that everybody sitting around us at our desks is our competition. But isn't the wonderful thing about employment knowing that someone else is going to tell you how much you can earn, someone else is going to tell you when and how you can get your bonus, and someone else is going to tell you if you're promoted, if they feel like it. I don't know. I don't know if that's yeah, so secure you're shooting and down all my ideas. I've got another idea. Mm -hmm. I could re-educate myself. I've often thought perhaps design wasn't going to make me a millionaire, right? Like Van Gogh. He was also Dutch. So I could re-educate myself. I could go do an MBA. I could maybe become a CA like you. That would be a good choice, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, what does it take to reskill yourself right now? How long have you been working for? How long have you been working for? Rob, how many years have you been working for? 20. 20? 20, 20, 20, 22 years? 20 years of, it, of work, 20 years of experience, 20 years of promotion, 20 years of labor. Now you can reskill yourself. So go out, um, you can do an MBA at Harvard or MIT. Of course, you want the best for yourself so you can accelerate your new chapter in your life. That's 50,000 US dollars. If you would like, you can do a local MBA. They're about 200,000 rand. No, there's nothing wrong in doing it, and it's a good skill, and maybe it'll get you an extra 6% at the next increase. Um, but if it's a proper reskilling, so you're somebody, you've been a carpenter and the carpenter industry is not working for you. If you're working for an iron ore company right now, that would be time to reskill. And you go and you reskill, you become a chartered accountant. Chartered accountant is a bit of a problem, an engineer, even a doctor, because you have to start in the mailroom. You go and you do your articles again. You have to work at uh, 3,000 rand a month, you know, um, until you qualify. And then you have to build your way back up the corporate ladder. Rob, are you willing to put another 20 years in to get back to the exact same position you're in right now? Okay, just tell us about your system. Okay, thanks, Rob. I'm glad. <laughs> Folks, you'll see that this is the pattern of the evening. You should really just stick with me. Um, the dew point system. We knew that we could not approach individuals in South Africa with this problem with these kind of solutions. They don't work, ladies and gentlemen. You might believe that they do. But if they do, you're part of the very small select few that they have worked for. We needed to do a more general solution. We needed a solution that was immediate that was material and that was, that was practical to everyone in South Africa. That is, not a big, that is not an easy thing to do. And this is what we came up with. This is what we call the dew point system. The dew point system is a system whereby you as individuals contract with us, dew point the insurer, as wealth engineers. You contract with us. As wealth engineers, you have one task for dew point. That is to create a channel of distribution. So some of you might have studied economics, you know what this is. Checkers, pick and pay, those are channels of distribution. They don't make the soap or the food that you buy. People who make the soap and the food that you buy use them as channels for distributing their products. And exactly the same way here at Dewpoint. Dewpoint is responsible for distributing their products into the channel of distribution that you've created for us. By doing this, you earn extra income. You'll note that that's not a replacement of your employment income. Not at all. In fact, that is contrary to what we're trying to achieve here. We produce for you extra income. It is that bridge over the gap you currently have in your income. You know where your debt is. You know where your expenses are. And at best, you're just meeting them. You're not getting ahead of them. We want to bridge that gap and get you ahead of your expenses and debt at this time. It is a recurring income. We don't have here boxes of widgets or toys or sticks or something that you have to go and run around and give to people and next month go back to the same people again who haven't finished using them and beg them to do it again. No. Ours is a debit order based system whereby every month payment is made and every month your income is produced for you on a recurring basis. Okay, so that makes sense to me. Obviously, extra income is a good thing. I particularly like recurring income because as a design professional, at our agency, we only made money with the amount of hours in the day that we had and the amount of designers that we had. If I wanted to make more money in the month, I would either have to hire more designers and developers or speak to God and ask Him to add some more hours into the day. So, and at the end of every month, we would reset to zero. And I would Start have again. to go out and do all the sales and all the marketing from scratch 
to produce the same amount of income that I did the previous month. Absolutely, Rob. And that is the state for almost all of us. And so with the DuPoint system, we specifically designed into it what we call the power of duplication. Again, not a completely uncommon term or theory, but we built it into the DuPoint system. And what it does is it means you are not limited to just the two hands you have and the eight hours of daylight that there are in the day. You are now able to harness the power of tens, hundreds, thousands of individuals, as you would if you owned a large corporation, all doing work towards achieving your objectives, your financial freedom. This is the power that's in there. It is also a completely flexible solution. So this, like I said to you, is not designed to replace what you're doing right now. It can be done 20 minutes a week. It can be done 40 hours a week and everywhere in between and beyond. It is designed specifically for you and specifically so that you can customize it. You remain completely independent in this process. I don't hold a staff meeting on Monday morning and ask you why you did so badly last week. I like that. I like that. I knew this would be I don't like wrong. staff meetings. That's right. We've got a meeting on Monday. <laughs> the entrepreneur in me likes the independence because I like to know that I'm responsible for my own time. I don't need anyone, you know, looking over my shoulder telling me what to do. So I like the independence aspect of it. I like to know that the benefits I reap from my efforts are my own doing. Excellent. Because that's what we want. That's what we want for everybody. With the DuPoint system, there is absolutely no startup cost. So I know for most of you, you're not silly people. You know what you're doing. You've walked in here and you've already guessed at what this is. Well, you've guessed incorrectly. Um, it makes you feel good that you guessed correctly, but you haven't. You've guessed incorrectly. <laughs> we are not taking 15,000 Rand from each of you this evening and promising you 45,000 Rand at the end of the week. That is not what happens. To become a wealth engineer, to contract to DuPoint costs you nothing. It costs you nothing tonight, and it'll cost you nothing every single month going forward. It requires no qualification. It requires no particular experience. You don't have to write any regulatory exams. You don't have to have any certificates. You don't need a compliance officer of your own. Hold on, hold on, it's hold on. You everybody. said risk-free, no startup capital. Like my wife said to me the first time I did a presentation to her, she said, you're lying. It can't be risk-free. Yeah. Isn't that sad? Are you that sure is, it's risk-free? This, this is it. It's very sad. Our natural position these days is one of skepticism. That's who we are. That's naturally who we are. And I promise you, as you get to know me, you will know that I'm a natural skeptic. And I come from a family of skeptics. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that was what I brought in when we designed this system. It is absolutely free. It is free of money. It is not free of your effort. Your effort is what makes this work. That is the price that you will pay. And we'll talk about that in a minute. But folks, let me not devalue what we're doing here by calling it free. We are building here arguably one of the only companies in the country that is building for individual South Africans real assets. I'm an accountant. I know what that is. So I'm not just throwing that term in because it sounds nice. A real asset, an asset that is saleable, an asset that is transferable, and an asset that will outlive you. When you pass away, the income that comes from your channel, you can bequeath to your family members, whether it's your spouse or whether it's one of your children or even your grandchildren. You can do that because you will have built a real asset with the DuPoint system. Okay, that's probably the most important benefit for me. I do not want to spend the next 15 years not creating equity in all the time and effort that I put into something. So to build value immediate value, real value, is important for me. Absolutely. So I want to see but that it's happen. how you do it, Rob. That's so important. Yeah. We understand, we know, that the vast majority of people are absolutely terrified of selling. I think they always talk about the, the, the ranked fears. One is public speaking, and two is death. Okay? <laughs> Which is good. I've managed to eliminate those two from my list. But I think that what they have forgotten is selling. Because whenever I talk to anybody about any job, they go, listen, as long as I'm not selling, I'm a strategy guy. <laughs> a strategy guy means I sit in an office and don't do anything. I've learned that over the years. But people, including my wife, goes, no way, I'm not doing this. I don't know how to sell. I'm like, listen, it's putting food on the table. Back up a bit, yeah. <laughs> Folks, there is absolutely no selling in the dew point system. We know that you can't sell. That's my job. Even as an accountant, I can sell. I've worked hard on this personality, spent a lot of money on it. <laughs> Folks, you don't do any selling in the DuPoint system. Your task is to create a channel distribution. DuPoint, the insurer's task, is to sell their products into your channel. 
As a result, there is no stock and no need for some form of distribution. You don't have to buy a bucky to become a wealth engineer. Back it up to our storeroom here and let me load up the protein shakes and the tablets and then whatever else. And you don't have to come back every day delivering it to your friends. It's not what happens at dew point it is designed for maximum convenience no selling no stock no distribution bridge how do you like that is and it's free <laughs> is this a real business there's this? no stock there's no selling no distribution you keep talking about these uh channels of distribution you're going to have to explain what channels of distribution Absolutely. are. Absolutely. would. Anyone in a t-shirt needs an explanation of what a channel of distribution is. So I appreciate that. And this that's what we're going to do tonight. Folks, it's very simple. It, we have taken all the barriers of entry out of this process. This might be hard for the natural skeptics in the room to believe, but it is what we have done. We have here 20 years of experience in the legislation, the compliance, the regulations, and the licensing of this kind of business. I have been through the review of four government departments, the DTI, the FSB, the National Consumer Commissioner, and there's another one, which are the Law Review Project. There we go. I have been through the process of that in the construction of this kind of business that we do here. Folks, you have one task left after all that work, and that is to tell everybody about the Dewpoint system. That's what you've got to do. The Dewpoint system that has allowed you to take control again of your financial future. That's the task, that's the message that you've done. As individuals get to hear about you point through your efforts, some will catch the vision, like we're hoping you will tonight. Those individuals will become wealth engineers who we will allocate to your channel. As those individuals go out and do exactly the same task that you have, they too will be allocated to you and your channel. And this process continues through an electronic system that we have devised and is online, and we're going to talk about it a little bit later. But ultimately, you end up with tens, maybe hundreds, maybe thousands of individuals who are all constructing a channel for your success and your financial future. Okay, let's not get carried away because I see you've got quite a skilled designer and he's laid this growth out very organically. And he's good, that's hey? pretty. He very good. Hiring. Very good. It looks nice. But I've got friends at the back here, and I'll quote one of my friends verbatim. If this is a pyramid scheme, I'm going to moor you. There we go. <laughs> Sounds South African. He's definitely local. Or she. I don't know. <laughs> she. She. Goodness. I well, know you're really in trouble. <laughs> I know. You better prove that this isn't one of them. Absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a scheme of any form. It is nothing like what you've read about in the newspapers. I told you it's the culmination of 20 years of working with regulators. And if any of you have ever worked with a regulator, you'll know why at 21 I'm completely gray. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, this is not a get-rich-quick scheme either. This is a real form of building income. It takes time, it takes effort, and it takes thought. But what it does is it changes your future <coughs> forever. You build sustainability, you build endurance, and you build something that carries you to the end with the dew point system here. Okay, it all sounds fairly convincing, but I've got some heavyweight friends here tonight, and you haven't got to the money yet. That's How right. much? Show me the money. Show it to me. That's right, absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, we haven't designed this system for people who are earning just five or six hundred rand a month. That's not what we've done. What we've done here is we've tried to create something that creates real value for all spheres of South Africa. And here is how it works. There are two ways that you earn with the dew point system. We have the first one which we call your base return. Your base return is a 27 Rand 50, pa uh, 50 payment that comes to you everybody, every time somebody in your channel makes a payment having taken a product from dew point. That 27 Rand 50 is multiplied by a factor on where the payment has been made in your channel. So for instance, those individuals that you spoke to in the beginning, uh, they've taken a product and made a payment. Every time they do, you get 27 Rand 50 times 200%. That's 55 Rand every month that that payment is made. The exact same thing occurs for individuals that they've spoken to who have become wealth engineers. They, as I've described to you, become allocated to your channel. As they make payments, you get 27 Rand 50 times 200%. And so this continues on an outward basis. As your channel grows, you receive payment for every product payment that is made in your channel. 
until you reach the eighth point. At the eighth point, you are receiving 4% of the 27 Rand 50. You need to understand that. This is people who you brought to Dew Point, who brought people to Dew Point, who brought people to Dew Point, who brought people to Dew Point to the eighth point. You do not know who these people are. You really don't. You have no connection to these individuals, but you are still earning 4% of 27 Rand 50 every time they make a payment. But it does not stop there. There is no limit to how much you can earn with the Dew Point system. Beyond the eighth point, you get a flat 4% every time a payment is made in your channel. So if there's 12 points in your channel and a payment is made on the 12th point, you'll get 4% of the 27 Rand 50. If you've got 30 points in your channel, on the 30th point a payment is made, you get 4% where you qualify to earn with the Dew Point system. Okay, that's a beautiful table you got there, and you're talking about limitless points and unlimited payments. But like I said, I've got heavyweights in the room who are probably charging. We've got a couple of lawyers here. Thousands of rands an hour. I know, I know. And you this know doesn't, I don't have the Excel app on, on my your phone, phone like you no, do. No surprise there, Rob. And also, I knew that the slide would confuse you. There's just too many <laughs> too numbers, many numbers. for you, Rob. Too okay, many numbers. So. I need to know how much I'm going to earn. Show me, show me, show me. Folks, we know that that is an issue for most people. I mean, that's a confusing table. And so what uh, Tim and I and Stacey did as the Chartered Account, we locked ourselves in a dark room with our favorite app, Excel, and we <laughs> spent many wonderful hours crunching the numbers. What we wanted to do was give you a real, real estimate of what you can potentially do with Dewpoint. As Rob says, it is being designed for all of us, no matter our job title, no matter our job description. We want real value coming out of this. So what we did is we sat down, we took our 10 or 15 years worth of experience each of this industry. We have a lot of data at hand on this. And we worked out what we guessed was, not guessed, what we calculated would be a very conservative growth rate of a channel of an individual who started as a wealth engineer here who had no experience whatsoever in building channels with um, Dewpoint. In other words, absolutely terrible in the beginning. And we came up with a formula, a growth formula we call the 3 plus 2 growth formula. The 3 plus 2 growth formula means that in your first month, you put just three people into your channel. You speak to just three people and they join you in your first month. Thereafter, for every month, on your first point, all you do is you put two people into your channel. That's one person every week. No, every two weeks, sorry. One person every two weeks. This is not a big request. If you have a full-time job, finding time to put two people in an entire month into your channel is not a big request, especially if it's changing your life forever. All right, so having applied that formula to our calculations and having included all the data we have on lapses, cancellations, your inability to duplicate that process, the three plus two, into all the people you bring into um, your channel, we calculated the following numbers, which we believe you could reasonably expect to earn at due point if you were consistent and applied time with the 3 plus 2 formula to your channel. This is what it does. If you were to do it for six months, we believe you'd be earning 2,500 Rand a month. Hold the phone. Stop the presses, my heavyweights. 2,500 Rand after six months. Let's queue up here to sign up. Six months of work, 2,500 Rand. That's my cell phone bill. Rob, you imbecile. I haven't <laughs> finished. There is many, there's many more months here. Folks, this is not a get-rich-quick scheme. This is a hard labor scheme that changes your life forever. But I think, Rob, you're underestimating the value of a free 2,500 Rand a month that, really? would be, that you'd be generating out of due point. If you were to take that 2,500 Rand a month and say this is an insignificant amount of money for me, it, it would barely pay my cell phone bill, and you just put it in your bond. You had a million rand house, okay, which is not a big house, but these days it's hard to find a house for less than a million rand. If you had a million rand bond, and you just said, I'm just going to chuck that two and a half thousand rand into my bond. Do you know that it would reduce the repayment on that bond by 9.4 years? Now, your repayment's about... 8.4 years. 8.4. You did the math on this, man. Designer gets you one up on the accountant. 8.4 years. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We'll give him one. We'll give him one. We'll give him one. I've got plenty more. 8.4 years. <laughs> 8.4 years, you know that you're paying about 10 or 11,000 Rand a month on your, on your 1 million Rand bond. Calculate how much 11,000 Rand a month is for 8.4 years. That's how much you would save by simply putting 2,500 Rand more in a month. That's after six months, okay? That I didn't know. No. <laughs> no, that's right. There's just too much Excel in there. Uh, if you were to push through to 12 months with us, 12 months, that's this time next year. We believe that you could be doing earning about 9 to 10,000 Rand a month. 9 to 10,000 mm. Rand. It doesn't matter who you are. 10 grand extra a month. You're going to feel. 
You're going to feel it one way or another. But we're not here for 12 months. We're here for the long haul because that's what the dew point system's about. After about um, 18 months, we reckon you'd be on about 18 to 20,000 rand a month. Remember, this is putting two people in a month on your first point. One every two weeks. One every two weeks. Applying your thought, applying your time, and trying your best to get all of those that you bring in to do the 3 plus 2 formula. We know what the drop-off rates are. They're built in. 18 months, you're on 18 to 20,000 rand a month. After 24 months, we believe you'd be on about 30,000 rand a month. Okay, 30, now we're rand. talking. 30 grand 30 a month grand. extra over and above my income. Every month. Then I, that's, uh, what's that? Not this coming Valentine's, next Valentine's. I can send my, my lovely wife over there, Valentine's card, say, lovey, you don't have to go to work anymore. Will you quit for 30,000 rand a month? No. 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 I was going to say, I could have guessed that. I was hoping she was going to say that because I plan on buying a 911 Turbo. That's right. 30 I think grand 30 grand will pay that Porsche. off. That'll get you the Porsche. What a Christmas gift for two years' time. Nice. Buy yourself a Porsche in two years' time. And we're not even being fun. This is not get rich stuff. This is very consistent work. <laughs> Three years with us, we reckon you could be earning about 50 grand a year with us at your point. Yeah, and there your clever designer. What's that? 30 months. Yeah, a month. 30, 50 After grand a 30 month. months, you're around 35, 36,000 rand a month. It says reduce a 5 million rand bond to less than seven years. So I'm 40 today. If I want to plan for retirement, I've got 20 years. So in about 20 years, 21 years, I can pay off three 5 million rand houses. Back to back. That's back right. to back. I'll have By three adding to the repayment, 50,000 rand a month. Yeah. Rent of 25,000 rand each plus whatever dew point is going to be paying me at that stage, I will have resigned my job. I could have over 100,000 Rand coming in a month in passive income. That's right. Now, you could also have nothing. You could have nothing. Three years could have passed and you can have nothing. You could continue doing whatever you're doing right now and be in exactly the same position. You could also have joined up with dew point and done nothing. And you will be getting nothing. This is not a 15,000 Rand today and a 45,000 Rand out on Friday exercise. This is three years of very consistent effort in creating a channel that's changing your life. Four years from now, we reckon you'll be on about 60 to 65,000 Rand a month. And five years from now, somewhere between 80 and 100,000 Rand a month. Five years from now. That's a bar. That's a million. Over a bar. We call it a bar. Over a bar every year. In five years' time. Five okay, years but time. five years, cheapest five years, you know. I did Ironman, it only took me four months to train for that, and that was fairly large. How am I going to commit to something like this for? <laughs> five years. Five years of evenings, five years of Saturday mornings, perhaps five years of time yeah. that you've committed to do it. For many people, that is too much to ask for. Too much to ask for. Five years is too long. Now, there's a couple of things we need to remember about five years these particular days. When was the Soccer World Cup? Six years ago. Six years ago. Does it feel like six years ago? No, it feels like six minutes ago. 2020 is on everybody's horizon. 2020 is nowhere. When you first got a job, right at the beginning, that very first job, as you walked up to whatever you were doing, if I'd walked up to you at that point in time and said to you, are you going to put five years into your career? You would have laughed, wouldn't you? Of course I'm going to put five years into my career. I'm going to put 30 years in my career. I've only just started. Why is five years such a big leap for you right now? This is a question you need to ask yourself. And of course, it doesn't end here. It goes on and on. If this is what you can do in five years, what could you do in 20? I like to speak to the youngsters at this stage. You 20. Imagine putting 10 years in. Do you believe in 10 years' time you could be earning 250,000 Rand a month? That's as much as the CEO of ESCOM. I don't think he's doing as much work so as he would be doing. Including bonuses. To be earning 250,000 Rand a month. But there it is. Okay. Could you do that in 10 years? 10 years is out there with the dew point system. Okay, so there's a lot of activity to do in five years, but you've shown us the money, but you haven't really told us how to do it. I have no idea, I don't know what channel building is, I have no idea how to start. So if I had to join, what do I do? Absolutely, and beyond drawing pictures, Rob, we have <laughs> put together what we call the dew point XP rewards program. It's simply a training program that we've designed for you. With, as I said, nearly 20 years of experience in this, we have put together lists of activities that take you from being an absolute beginner channel builder through to an absolute expert channel builder. Each activity rewards you with what we call XP, your experience. It is an accumulating balance of experience that along the way we reward you for achieving. 
So by doing tasks, in addition to the returns that we just discussed, we reward you with things like holidays, <coughs> here and overseas, motor cars, you can see we're not playing around here, motor cars, cash and tools that will assist you in growing your channel with two points. So here's basically how it works. You perform the tasks in the XP Rewards program and you get experience points. As you do these tasks, naturally your channel will grow. Where you're able to get the XP and the growth, we start to reward you. It's small amounts of money in the beginning because it's quite easy in the beginning to do the, big, the basic steps. But we get you going, this is in addition to those returns that we were just talking about. As you get a little bit more experienced, so do the rewards get a little bit more valuable okay, for you. Okay, let me tell, this is the exciting I part. Thought Rob Hand it over to this. me, we don't need a boring accountant voice to tell you about the exciting stuff. These are the tools that we were talking about. So look at rank number five. You get a 1200 Rand crystal memory stick. So the designer in me Googled the world and I found the most beautiful USB stick imaginable. And you're probably thinking that sounds absolutely ridiculous. And perhaps it is. But over and above that, the tools that Brendan mentioned, we make it easier for you guys to build your channels. So on that memory stick, we put on all the development seminars we do, all the training collateral we have, all the presentations to make it easier for you guys to build your channel and faster. But if you look at rank number seven, 7,000 Rand premium business cards. You know how excited a designer gets when he can spend 7,000 Rand on designing business cards. And you might be wondering, again, that sounds absolutely ridiculous. But imagine arriving at a party in a Bugatti Veyron. That's what these business cards are like. <laughs> 700 grams of blackboard with gold gilding around the edges, the Dewpoint logo in gold embossed foil. When you place one of these into someone's hand, like the guy who arrives at the party in the Veyron, they're going to ask, what is Dewpoint and what do you do for them? Again, tools that help you build your channel more effectively. But even more exciting, it's rank number nine, an annual family vacation. All of these rewards over here are once-offs, except for this one. This one, we take you on every single year. Not any vacation, a five-star resort, business class tickets for you and your family. The only thing you need to worry about is getting the leave from HR. <laughs> and when your boss finds out that you are flying business class every <coughs> bloody year to this holiday destination, he's going to be phoning HR to check how much you're getting paid. And he'll probably be joining Dewpoint shortly after. Absolutely. This will be a problem for you, I promise you. Going every year away will become a problem for you. <laughs> Folks, like the returns, the XP program has no limit. It continues to grow as your channel continues to grow. The more you do, the more experience you get, the greater the rewards become. And these are on top of what you're doing currently. It is the bridge that covers the gap that you currently have, every one of us has, no matter what we are doing right now. And I'm only the marketing guy. Oh boy, here we go. Okay. <laughs> and I'm looking at the returns and the rewards, and I'm starting to get a little bit nervous because it seems like we are throwing money at the wealth engineers here. Throwing money away. Are you sure your maths is working out? Yeah. I thought that that question might come up. So I, I didn't put, put the slide, slide in. in. I put my own slide in this evening. I don't think about ponies. That's right. Those are unicorns. Those are unicorns, Rob. That's all you ever think of. Folks, Jeez. the maths is simple. I have had many people tell me the maths doesn't work, mainly doctors. Um, and as an accountant, I can assure you the maths does work. We, I've been involved in the financial services industry for nearly 20 years. And I have often had to price and build products um, in the financial services industry. We spend, as an industry, Billions every year on traditional advertising. You can't turn a TV on. You can barely turn your cell phone on. You can't turn your computer on without one of our adverts hitting you. We spend billions on traditional forms of advertising. And what we do is we know what it costs. We have years of data. And we back calculate the cost of that marketing into all of our product payments. Whether they're monthly, whether they're annual, they include sometimes as much as 35% marketing cost in them. That money we know. But what we did with the Dewpoint system is we said, well, instead of spending all of that money on traditional forms of advertising, 
We will use you to build those channels of distribution for us, which we do not then need to advertise into. And instead, we will give you the cash that we would have spent on marketing. You'll never see a Dewpoint ad outside of this building. You'll never see it. That money is for you and for your channel. Rob, okay. you got it now. It's about I'm getting as it. I'm getting it. it for I'm you, getting Rob. it. Less numbers, but I'm very familiar with this model. I mean, I was, you know, I ran a digital agency. I understood that a lot of our big brand clients were spending a lot on marketing and advertising. And you mentioned we're going to use our wealth engineers and the channels of distribution to get product to market. That's right. What product? Well, it won't be foot-long toothpaste. I'll <laughs> tell you that. Folks, what we have done is we have designed products that tackle the same problem as the problem we've been talking about all night long. Our first problem is that none of us have any assets that aren't encumbered with debt. We want to start creating for individuals in South Africa of all ages, not just the 55 plus, of all ages, assets that are unencumbered. So our first product is called our Access Wealth Plan. It is an investment plan. It costs you the princely sum of 249 Rand a month, of which 100 Rand is immediately put into an investment for you. 100 Rand. So the real cost of the Access Wealth Plan is 149 Rand to you because 100 Rand goes into an investment account. This investment account is a no deposit, no notice, no restriction period account. That means the money is available to you. We don't want you to take it out because we're trying to create an asset for you, but it is available to you immediately. Okay, that's great. So you're going to create an asset for me, but 100 bucks a month it is, is going to get isn't me, it? what, a whole 1,200. I get hit by a bus in a year's time and I can seed all this value to my daughter, it'll probably put her through pre-primary for about a week. I know, isn't that appalling? <laughs> True, the minimum is 100 Rand. But let's look at that minimum of 100 Rand. We know that life does not work out as we expected it to. I mean, we've been discussing that all night long. What we know, though, is that we can give you some protection. And so we've built into the plan some risk protection. We've put 100,000 rands worth of personal accident cover into the investment plan. So, Rob, when you are run over by the bus, shot, hijacked, mugged in the street and killed, beaten to death, fall off a ladder, fall out a tree, break a heel and fall over and kill yourself in the <laughs> high heel stilettos, whatever it is, your beneficiaries won't get the 1,200 rand. They'll get 100,000 rand. Now, I'd like to do it like Zuma, so it's 100 and 1,200. No. 101,200 Rand is what they would get. What we have created with the Access Wealth Plan is an asset of immediate and significant value. 100,000 Rand of personal accident covered to you if you are not given the time in this life to build that asset for yourself. Folks, the next product that we designed is called our Wealth Guard product. Our Wealth Guard product was designed um, specifically to enhance the risk protection of the Access Wealth Plan. What it does is for an additional 249 Rand a month, it adds another million Rands worth of personal accident cover to your Access Wealth Plan. A million Rand. That means, Rob, when you get knocked over by a bus 12 months from now, you don't get 100,000 Rand. You get 1.1 million Rand paid to your beneficiaries. You know, that maybe works for me, but I mean, that's, a, that's an insurance product. Um, 249 Rand a month. I mean, anyone who's tried to get cover... I mean, maybe that's only for the 18-year-old. I mean, you look at my folks, they're in their late 60s. Mm -hmm. They try to get cover, it's going to be like 10,000 Rand a month. Yeah, I know. It's a very real problem in South Africa. It's a very real problem for people who are over the age of 65. Cover becomes almost something that is no longer in existence. Folks, with our Wealth Card Plan and our Access Wealth Plan, there is no minimum, no maximum age whatsoever. If you're 18 years or older, it doesn't matter if you're 100 years old, you can take our two products. There is no medical examination and no medical declaration that needs to be had to have our products. Folks, the last product that we have on display this evening at least is our Wealth Points program. We have that problem I told you at the beginning where I can give you a solution that says, oh, I'll just come in and cut all your expenditure and, and all of that, get you a smaller car and throw your kids out of private school and all of that and we can pay off your debts. It's not practical. Nobody wants to sacrifice their lifestyle to be able to get a little bit more income. So what we said is, can we create something that makes your expenditure more efficient? You spend the same, but with less rands and you get the same outcome. So we created our Wealth Points program for 249 rand a month. We have used the power of Constantia's vast network in the industry of South Africa to bargain and negotiate and get for you the best prices, discounts, vouchers, packages, and access to 
um, uh, products that will change the way you spend your money. More exciting stuff. Let me mm -hmm. go okay. back, go back, go sorry, back. Sorry, Let sorry. me tell everyone about our suppliers in the Wealth Points program. So the first one there you can see is the Entertainer. It is a buy one, get one free voucher system. Now, when we first looked at it, I thought, oh, buy one, get one free voucher system. Let me tell you, this is a crazy voucher system. It is 1.2 million rands worth of vouchers. Right? I downloaded the app. I thought, oh, the app's quite cool. They came and delivered a voucher book to our office. It was like two Bibles put together. It is a, an insane amount of vouchers in there. Access to the top restaurants. So if you go to Turn and Tender up the road, yeah? at Nickelway, with all the fancy Bryanston people. You can go order a succulent T-bone steak for 150 bucks, and you can force your wife to have one for free. <laughs> Access to all the spas. So if you like my wife, she will spend the entire day at the spa for the rest of her life, if she could. Access to the top hotels around the world. Live events. Plenty of entertainment in there. You get access to that. The flight center. We've got dedicated account managers at the flight center for Dewpoint Wealth Engineers only. So if you're traveling leisure or business, they can book your itinerary for you at rates that no one else is getting. And the same goes for the rest of the retailers. Hershey's, ShopRite, Checkers, and Take-A-Lot. Again, discounted rates like Brendan mentioned, only available to Wealth Engineers. And all of this, folks, for about an, a, re a real cost of 149 Rand a month, because 100 of your 249 <coughs> is converted into wealth points which you use in your purchases here. Folks, it's not just all about the products or the system or the earnings. What we have created here is access to everybody to become expert channel builders. We have given you free access to what we humbly believe are the best industry experts in the space in the, com in the country. We're right here in Joburg. This entire office has been designed for your free use. We have auditoriums like this. We have boardrooms available for you to use. We have rooms, meeting rooms for you to use. There's free Wi-Fi here of the finest quality. I kid you not, our routers have 280 aerials in them. When you log in, you're allocated an aerial. The aerial points at you on an electric engine wherever you walk around our office. I kid you not. That's the technology we have available for free for you here. Right. Free tea, free coffee, anytime. We want you in here, and we're here to support you. But that's, it's all Joburg, right? It's all this here. Yeah, the, it's all here. Yeah. I am bleeding mates to the Republic of Cape Town at a rate at the moment. How, are, how am I expected to do the channel building if... It's only stuck Joe to Joe based. Based. Absolutely, Rob. Absolutely. As a wealth engineer, you have immediate access to the entire country. You have national footprint. We have all of our tools online. Everything to do with Dewpoint is online. Anywhere in the world, real time, you have access to your channel. You have access to introducing people to the Dewpoint system. And all of our major presentations, training sessions, um, everything that we do here is live streamed. It's live streamed out to the whole nation. We've had people in France watching us. Um, for this and we do it in HD so you don't ever have to be embarrassed everything <laughs> that we have done here at Dewpoint is for your maximum success we are the premier direct selling company in South Africa today and you will never be without support when you care we will take you from beginner to expert and so Rob it's decision time do you think you can make a decision with that t-shirt on you know just because I'm a designer doesn't mean I'm impulsive I'm actually one of those decision makers that takes a really long time to make any decision, especially one as weighty as this. So I probably need more time to decide. Absolutely. Rob, many people feel that way. I have two of them in my own household, my son and my wife. It is quite <laughs> annoying, but it is a reality. <laughs> Folks, there's one thing we don't have a lot of anymore. I feel it every single day, and that's time. That's time. If I was here saying to you this evening, you need to pay me 15,000 Rand before you leave this evening to become a wealth engineer, I would understand your reluctance. Right now, as a South African, in the current set of circumstances, economic and politically, you don't have a lot of options. You don't. I'm not doing that to scare you. I'm telling you the reality. Go watch TV tonight and tell me how you feel after you've done it. Okay? We do not have time. Every second that passes is a second you could have spent changing your future. It's a second you could have spent taking control of your own destiny. That is what we are doing here at Dewpoint. We are giving you the tools to do that in a completely risk-free environment. It is a legitimate decision tonight for you to go, no, the path I am on will lead me to financial and time freedom. That is a legitimate decision. I just want you to have properly considered 
all of the realities of a decision like that before you leave tonight. Alternatively, alternatively your choice is to become a wealth engineer. It costs you nothing, and it gives you something that you might just be able to change your future with. Rob, are we clear? We're clear. But uh, not necessarily ready to make a decision yet. But if I was, if I was, you haven't said anything about how I join. What do I do next if I want to join? Absolutely. Like everything, we try to make it as easy as possible. It's three things you've got to do. Three things you've got to do tonight. One is pull out your smartphone, pull out your tablet, jump on a computer, go outside to one of our iPads that are outside, fill out an application form and become a wealth engineer tonight. It's very quick. It'll take you two minutes to become a wealth engineer. Once you have, sit down with the person that brought you here this evening. We call them your lead wealth engineers. Chat to them. What is that dream that you settled on? What is that aspiration that has faded? Let's put that back on the horizon again, and let's say that that is the thing that we want. Once you have the goal, you can make the plan, and you can start working towards it. And then you go out and do the easiest thing in the world to do, whether you like selling or not. Is talk to people about the Dewpoint system. That's all you have to do. Talk to people about how you've taken control of your life again, taken control of your future, and how, for the first time possibly, since you left school, you are dictating your future. That's what you're doing. And that is our Throwdown Thursday, guys. So thank you. I had to bring a little bit of fun into the accountants' lives. It's exhausting, Rob. <laughs> but in all sincerity, uh, I hope that we've addressed a lot of the questions that you guys might have had. Um, and you are very welcome to come speak to us. Uh, we've discussed all the benefits of the opportunity that was presented tonight. And, you know, I'm, I'm married to a labor lawyer. Uh, we have the fun of dealing with retrenchment in our house every single night. Um, my wife works for one of the most established businesses in the country, if not the world. And they are having retrenchments happening left, right, and center around them. Not only people at entry-level salaries. We're talking about professionals, accountants, engineers. You know, I ran a business for 15 years of my life. I don't have anything to show for it. I've got the experience, but in terms of equity, I had to walk away. So you guys have been presented with an opportunity. I hope you're seriously considering it. I challenge you to come speak to us afterwards if you think there's anything better out there in South Africa that exists for us. Thank you. So come chat to us. There's, we are all here tonight. Um, we are looking forward to speaking to you and getting to know you better. Thank you again. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, meet us outside, some coffee, some tea, and we'll chat to you there.